Yeah, well, guess who has to get her tonsils out the week before Christmas? Better to have a short life that is full of what you like doing than a long life spent in a miserable way. Hi guys. So I've realised I haven't done any kind of like vlog video since I moved back home. Which is rude. It's, it's fully rude. So if you don't know, I recently moved back home. I'm living at home with my dad in Toom and I alternate then up and um, staying at my mom's house. But wait till you hear I have news, okay? So I have trouble with my tonsils. I have since I had glandular fever. I had glandular fever maybe like four years ago and I had it for like a year and a half and it was really bad and my tonsils just haven't been the same but I have a high pain tolerance so <laughs> if I say so myself. I just was living with the pain but I can't do it anymore so I'm getting them taken out and they can only take me a week before Christmas. I might be drinking my Christmas dinner out of a straw. I shall not be able to partake in 12 pubs for anyone who doesn't know. I've actually never done this, but 12 pubs is a tradition in Ireland, just Ireland. Should I Google that? 12 pubs. I think it's an Irish thing. Okay, so 12 pubs basically, it's like a play on the song, the 12 pubs of Christmas, or sorry, no, the 12 days of Christmas. You just go to 12 different pubs and have a drink in different pubs. Sometimes there's these rules and stuff, but as I said, I have never been on one. I've never gone out on one, so I was adamant that this year I would do one. But um, looks like I won't be joining in. And hey, looks like the government might not let any of you guys either. get over how horrendous I look right now but you know what makes me so happy like life's simple pleasures of sitting outside for like 30 minutes maybe 20 outside with a book or with no book and just like sitting there okay sounds so whimsical but it is whimsical I always feel so much better and I'm just sitting outside for 20 minutes and I'm reading my book and I just I just don't know if there's anything better and also the garden out here is so nice this time of year Look at all the leaves. My footwear is, is it's very important, okay? As as are my velvet leggings. But look at all the leaves. It's so beautiful. The moment you have a situation where you are really in control of things, that is to say in which the future is almost completely predictable. Okay guys, so I'm actually at Peter's house. Peter is, Peter is going to America for a month. This is his last evening before he goes. So I'm just hanging out with him for his last evening. He is going out to get the shopping bag full of stuff that his mom got him for his flight. Show me all the stuff. <laughs> body spray here, body wash. <laughs> and a cleansing bath. He sends his mom out to get these flight socks. What are they good for, Pete? Circulation. <laughs> P20! Two masks. <laughs> and he has smooths for my allergies. <laughs> Just ginger boy things. Oh, wait, 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 wait. <laughs> okay, this is enough. This is enough. Basically, you're just spoiled rotten. That's the whole point of this, isn't it? Just spoiled rotten, aren't you? Yeah. <laughs> okay, so we're packing, and this tiny suitcase is the only thing Peter wants to bring for the month because, in fairness, he's moving around loads. And also because he said clothes are not necessary. Yes. But these, these are the amount of shoes he's bringing. Are you gonna miss me? I'm not gonna miss you. Yeah.
just went into the cinema. Cinema? <laughs> we literally just went into Gather. So the Abbott part of it has like takeaway coffee. And we literally just went in for a takeaway coffee and like a scone or something. Got a three course meal. We got fully hoodwinked, got hoodwinked by the lady in there and we sat down and had a glass of wine and two courses. <laughs> And it was stunning. Would definitely recommend. I've never actually sat in there and it's so nice. So, so nice. We're gonna actually try and book it for like Christmas Eve or something. It'd be cute. And we had the chowder and it was so nice. We were saying, um, mom lives beside O'Grady's up in Barna and that's like really nice chowder. And this one was nicer. So, we think so. We think so anyway. <laughs> mom locked the keys <laughs> into the bedroom. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> you can actually see them in the car. Oh my god. <laughs> I am in the boot of the car. <laughs> Trying to find the key. <laughs> There's no, There's no the key. Okay, will you use the light? Stephanie, what are you doing videoing? I'm just taking a video. <laughs> Absolutely spectacular. Mob wife. <laughs> look at the two pieces of hair, they look like horns. <laughs> what the hell is this about? The East spoke the same, had the same dream, same pain and same feelings. Staring at the sea and what was left of me. Patiently, Sam, people sit and wait anxiously. This is my favorite little walk. It's the shortest, probably the shortest walk on a beach ever, but I just love it so much. I've always loved it since I was a little girl. Good morning, just getting ready for the day. Look how cold it is, ready? Can you see that? Okay, proper good morning. Hello, hi. We are going to go into Galway now and look what my mom put up last night. We adore. We adore.
December 1st, which means one thing, Spotify wrapped is available. If you don't know what Spotify wrapped is, aka my mother who's watching this, um, Spotify put all the statistics together from everything you've listened to from the year and they'll tell you what you listen to the most basically. So I was like, I'm opening this up with you guys because I already know it's going to be terrible. And I opened up my iPad and look at the last thing I played on my iPad. Soft music for dogs. Soft music for dogs. Let's see how this goes. That's a great song. I'm happy about that one. <laughs> uh oh. Are we enjoying this? It's actually not as well as I thought it'd be. Okay, my songs. Let's see. Okay. Okay, I would say that's correct. Oh, that's so cute. I'm fully. I'm so surprised this is not a dog account on this. Okay, I know it's really dark in here. If I've learned anything from James Kavanagh, it's no overhead lighting. No overhead lighting. Please note that my curtain is not down all the way. Why is your curtain not down all the way, Stephanie? It's broken. It's broken. And it's been broken for about two weeks now. And you know what? I'm not very inclined to fix it. Like right now, it's annoying me. Anybody could be watching me and I don't know. So that's one thing. That's not ideal. But the sun naturally wakes me up in the morning. Beautiful. Beautiful. I kind of mentioned this in my last video of the Christmas gifts, the sunrise alarm clock. I have a sunrise alarm clock right here. It's so nice um, because I'm not being like awoken suddenly by an alarm. And sunrise now is, it's not 5am. What is this on my hands? But it's just so nice. And I never sleep in now, but it's not, it all feels very natural. It feels like I'm part of nature. Do you know what's not ideal? When you're going to bed, so I have all these candles on, right? I'm watching a movie, I have this light off, and it's just so nice. It's just so nice. Watch this. Oh, it's just so gothic. But then I'm like starting to fall asleep. I have to get up and blow them all out. <laughs> Einstein, I don't like that. Let's sort something out here. I reckon that I have very plain music taste, like very normal, nothing out the box. But I reckon I'm very good at making playlists. Again, another self-proclaimed title, but I feel like my playlists are good. My name is Stephanie Blatt on Spotify, if you wanna check it out and tell me if I'm wrong. There's one I just made recently for my friend Owen's birthday and it's called Girls, Gays and Days. Now there was one male at the party who complained that I was being sexist with the name. I'm basically just going to set up shop for the evening here, chill out, I'm going to read my book. Am I coming towards the end of this? I have opinions. I have opinions. I feel like I might possibly do like a separate video going through like all the books I read this year and like rating them. Would you be interested? But yes, going to end the vlog there. I hope you enjoyed. And did you want it?